When I was younger, I had always seen gentlemen's magazines. I always, in my head, wanted to be that kind of model. But I also knew that I was always going to be too fat. I'm Kelly Shabari. I run a PR and marketing firm for the entertainment industry, and I also do porn. When somebody suggested that I get into porn, my first reaction was there's no fat girls in porn. What I saw was they were all really slender, and I found that there's a lot of women and men of all different shapes and sizes who do porn. When I first got into the business, plus size was still very much a specialty category, um, and so a lot of the, the products that were being pushed out there had nothing to do with actually like plus size positivity, it had everything to do with let's fetishize fat bodies. You know, I did uh, a few scenes for some websites that involved having sex with parts of my body that weren't necessarily my sex organs. So it was, you know, hey, can you have sex with like between the folds of your, your stomach? You know, that kind of thing. And, and so it kind of really kind of pushed that stereotype. And so I think at one point I went, you know what? This isn't the kind of sex I have at home. So why am I doing that? So I started saying no to those specific kinds of scenes. I think that once you make the decision to not take every job that comes your way, you know that you're doing the work that you want to do. I get to go home and say, wow, I had a great day and created some really good content that I know my fans will like. And that in itself is empowering. I am the first plus size model to ever have been chosen for a pictorial in Penthouse Magazine from being the girl who wanted to be in a magazine but knowing that I couldn't or, being, or telling myself that I couldn't to finally finding that, yes, I actually can. It feels like I, I've come full circle. But I really don't want it to just kind of stop there. I think that there's a lot more the adult entertainment community can do to bring plus size sexuality to the public. I'm hoping that I'm able to keep pushing open doors that then other plus size models can then walk through. Everybody's perception of beauty is different. I can't ever be the prettiest. I can't ever be the best at something. But what I can do is be the first. And if you're the first, then no matter how many people come after you, people will always remember you for having been the first. So I